Wait, to work this out. He could use the clicker to undo the horror story. I need to get back to Brightfall. I'm awake. I should check in with Casey. Another one of those cult boxes. I need something to cut this. Come on, Casey. No answer. David. Pick up, pick up, pick up. Hey, this is David. Leave a message. David, can you call me back, please? It's urgent. Please. Why isn't David answering? Is Logan all right? How does this all work? Has a horror story already gotten her? Wake should know. The flooding's lowered. I should look around, see where the water was hiding.
Marisetter is not afraid of the rough questions. I need to get the clicker to wake and close this damn case before my family gets dragged any further into it. Double edited it into a horror story that's now changing reality, taking over people. Miss Murray, do you see one float in the shape of a swan? All of them. A little clothes pindle. Perfect weird souvenir for Logan. There's something written here. A poem? Or a riddle? Reminds me of the nursery rhymes I read to Logan when she was little. Hmm. Think Saga.
Oh. Nope. Doesn't look right. Doesn't make sense. No. Ugh. That's not right. Keep trying. Nah. Hmm. Think, Saga. Doesn't make sense. Nope. No. Creepy dolls, mysterious rhymes, no weirder than anything else going on, I guess. I don't have the key. No. Doesn't look right. That's not right. Keep trying. Something feels different. I should look around. What is this? Ah, can't forget the dolls.
Another cult stash? Need the key. Charm. Cute. It'll go great on the bracelet Logan made for me. Huh. That was strange. Gotta keep an eye out for more of these rhymes. Doesn't make sense. Q. 
Keep trying. This bridge got fixed quick. I don't think everything's okay in coffee world. Have you noticed? I'm getting this, like, off feeling every night after work. Quite the show that Otzi fell up with. Yeah, cool. We're going to Akuga's house to drink some whiskeys. Are you coming? No, Ilmo. I'm very busy wearing a turtleneck and drinking wine. Like an asshole. Oh, dear. I know what Yasko needs. Alan Wake. Hmm. My name comes up, your books come up, you come up. I've read them. There are echoes of my life in there that makes me feel like someone's been watching me. What happened to Alan Wake? The unanswered mystery. Never expected to find you alive. Oh, my head's killing me. I think you like using people, Wake. Taking their lives and twisting them into your stories. And when someone gets hurt, it's kick-ass material for the next one. Shit! Spilled my coffee. I take it you're not a fan, then, Agent Casey. This is not your playground, and I'm not your fucking creation. It doesn't work that way. You can't make something out of nothing, even in a dark place where the rules hardly apply. It's very complicated to make fiction come true. I saw visions of what's happening, what will happen. Dreams. I tried to use them in my writing. I understand how dangerous it is now. Even with a paralyzing amount of planning. I think I stopped writing. I think I gave up. But there's a manuscript. Maybe I forgot not to write. The dark place makes you forget. just want to fix this. Find a version of the story that fixes everything. Shut up! Get down! FBI! We want the writer! No one else needs to get hurt! Fuck off!
I had escaped the dark place. So had the dark presence. Scratch. He was here, in Bright Falls. I could feel him as a growing pressure in my head. Stronger by the minute. Why didn't he kill me with the rest? What did he want? I needed to find Casey. We were on the same side in this fight. Strength in numbers. I need to protect myself. A gun and a flashlight. How nostalgic. Casey, he was still alive. I were after. Were they letting themselves be taken? Or did the dark presence not discriminate? The pressure in my head was unbearable. Scratch was getting closer, stronger than ever. Casey! Look out! It's him! Scratch is... The pressure eased off. Scratch was further away. I could think again. Casey. Casey, I'm coming! Fuck. Nesteves, Federal Bureau of Control. We'll take it from here. Out cold. Wait. This is my case. This is no longer an FBI investigation. The case has been transferred to us. This is bullshit. Noted. We're moving the evidence and paperwork from your field office to our base of operation at the Sheriff's Station. Any other pieces of evidence with you? Anything relevant? The clicker. I can't trust them with it. Nothing comes to mind. Okay. Then your work here is done. Hey. You did well. Wait. My partner, Agent Casey's MIA. We'll look for He's him. He's my partner, damn it. Agent. I should be... Go home. Careful, moving quick. They think he's a para-utilitarian. No. Fuck this. I was so close to getting the clicker to wake. I'm not done here. Not until I find Casey. Not until my family is safe from this horror story. Tor and Odin were in the photo with a the clicker. They might know how it works. I'm off the case, but I can still visit family. Hello? Saga! It's Tor, your grandfather. About time you were coming to visit, kiddo. 
How did you know I was coming to see you? Never mind that. We have bigger problems. We're losing. Ow! Fuck! Fuck you, you fucking hag! Fuck! Shit. Something is off at that nursing home. The Valhalla Nursing Home, founded in 2014 for Odin and Tor Anderson of the Old Gods of Asgard fame for their twilight years. Built after the return comeback tour, flip-flop to be their farewell tour, cut short, canceled. As their agent, Barry Wheeler had managed to coax a few hit songs out of them before that. Balance lays the demon, a couple of others. The old men rocked like their namesakes. The backstage parties got out of hand. The air was thick with smoke. Wheeler squinted. His migraine flared, booze and drugs. A rock and roll cliche. They ran off after every gig. Wheeler had security track them down to the craziest after parties. Torrin Odin might know something about the clicker. With Wake out of reach, this is my best lead. Think Saga.
Another cult box. Another one of those rhymes. That's not right. No. Keep trying. Doesn't look right. Think, Saga. Nah. <laughs> Doesn't make sense. Nope. not right. No. Keep trying. Doesn't make sense. Doesn't look right. Nah. Think, Saga. Nope. Tor and Odin claim to be my family. I know Logan and I never lived here. But I don't know enough about my family history to say they're not my relatives. Mom only ever said my grandfather was bad news. The less I knew her. Vote Mayor Setter to sit in office.
getting the... Oh! Saga? What's up? Hello, Rose. Thought I'd swing by, see the family. Not a bad time, is it? Oh, no. I was just, you know, tidying the, uh... The, um... I'm so glad you're visiting again, Saga. But Odin and Tor can't see anyone today. I was just on the phone with Tor. He invited me over. Sorry. They had a little too much fun on our trip to Watery and need to rest. I need an excuse to get in and talk to them. That's too bad. Okay if I say hi to the other residents before I go. Um... Sure. They always love visitors. Come on in. Not smart to be outside when the sun goes down. I love the architecture. I always dreamed of living in a haunted Victorian manor. <laughs> you say that like it's your first time here. <laughs> Here's some of our residents, or, as I like to call them, our little Vikings. Look who swung by, everyone. Norman, clothes. Norman, we have a visitor. Where are your clothes? Oh, I'm, I'm headed back to the sauna with Artie. <sighs> Just another day in Valhalla. I should really get back to work, Saga. But feel free to spend some time with Mandy May and Norman here. It's good for them to have company. Tor and Odin are here somewhere. Need to find them. Ati, this is your home. You don't need to keep cleaning. I take that mop away, but I know you'll just find it again. Girl, girl, what a wash up the people no. Why rest when you are poor to work? <laughs> And you know Mr. Bloom doesn't like it when you take it. I feel bad for these guys. Need to find the key. Very old. I shouldn't the interrupt him. built a bunker here during World War II to watch the ocean for Axis navies and who knows what else. Ever since they sealed the bunker, it's been a hot spot for teens. The Ocean View Motel and Spa, they call it. Ironically, I believe. They go there to enjoy their beer and their vapes and their electronic cigarettes. Ridiculous. The future is... <clears throat> Need the key. So, the teens would drink there. Do other stuff that isn't appropriate content for you listeners at home. This is Tor's room. More moonshine. Was this a drunken rampage? This place is a mess. And Tor's not here. Excuse me, miss, but you don't see me barging into your room while you're performing mental and physical strengthening exercises, do you? I thought not. Sorry. <laughs> don't mind me. And now I have. Odin's in bad shape. He was drunk and watery. Or is this something more serious? Can you hear me, Odin? <laughs> Odin Abison? Can you hear me? I need to ask you a couple of questions. Odin? He's in no shape to talk. Odin's in rough shape. What happened to him? 
These are our twilight years. There's darkness in the water. We have our little tricks. And so do you. What's happening? It's never felt this way before. You're all grown up, Saga dearest. And you're back just in time. The forces of darkness are eating away at us. We're too old and weak. You have the power in you, like all Andersons. What was that? He wasn't a projection. Odin was really here. We were connected. Are they really my family? Is that why this is happening? I found a photograph of you with the cultists. How are you involved? We're too old for this brand of crazy. But we'll drink with anyone who's offering. The cult's been on our asses to join for years. But we already have our band. And those damn fools don't know what they're dealing with. No wonder they want a pair of legends. Tor and Odin are not part of the cult. The cult thinks there's something special about Tor and Odin. I'm starting to see it too. I've never connected to someone like this in my mind place before. How is this happening? I was glad to answer your call. Vikings are born travelers. You are a seer. You can see the truth. But your grandpa will want to tell you more himself. Wouldn't want to steal his thunder. Tor is in danger. You can save him. Is my mind place more than just a mental technique? Sometimes my mind place even baffles me. Is this the reason? Is there something more than intuition behind it? One thing at a time. Tor is in trouble. Once I help him, he can maybe tell me more. You said Tor is in danger. What's going on? Darkness is drawn to the spark. Tor only thinks with his hammer, never his head. The Prince of fucking Darkness is making a comeback. Tor is marked by darkness. I can feel it. Is he in his room? It wants to take him, and then take me. Beware of Cynthia Weaver. Bad things happen in the wellness center. Don't let her drag him under, Saga. Does Prince of Darkness refer to Scratch? Is Tor becoming taken? I need to find him before it's too late. Stop this before more people get hurt. I found Wake's clicker. What can you tell me about it? Cut off from Tom's lamp. It washed to the shore. Good work getting the light switch. The light switch is like an amp. You can play rock and roll without it, but you won't blow anyone away. Art, like Tom's writing, can change the world. But the light switch will crank that change to 11. The clicker has the power to change the story. To save Logan. This confirms what Wake said. I can't let Scratch get his hands on the clicker. By Tom's writing, Odin must mean Wake. Clicker makes Wake's writing change reality. Can I trust him with that much power? Not sure I have a choice. Tor is not okay. Something is definitely going on here.
days ago. Getting in is forbidden, for your own safety. Time is long for those who wait, but in the end, stand to dance. Sheesh, <laughs> didn't see you there. I don't have the key. Need the key. Hello there, Saga Anderson. Hey, Pazine, name won't make the man worse. <laughs> Even a Swedish name. I'm Ahti. Anything good on that jukebox? We try to do good, but only prime comes out. <laughs> Music from my Swedish brothers, old gods of Asgard. My pals, the Berkele Vikings. Were you in the band? Minäkö? No, no. Perkele, saatana, en ollu en. Not so much sweet that it fills the whole stomach. But uh, we have shared a stage or two. You said I'd been here before. When was the last time I visited? Let's see exactly what she thinks she remembers. Oh, it's been years. We were all so sad when you left. After the accident. Oh, fuck this. My daughter didn't drown. You're remembering wrong. She's at home watching Night Springs with her father. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's useless. I need to stop the story. Tor is in the wellness center, isn't he? No, he's... Well, yes, but you really shouldn't go in there right now. I'm gonna need you to unlock the door. This is FBI business. But it's just... There's some things that, uh... <sighs> yes, okay, I'll let you in. Thank you, Rose. Watch out for puddles. You can hurt yourself in the dark. Right. That lady is a walking red flag. Odin said Tor needs help. But from what? Is he turning into a Taken?
It's Saga Anderson. He's hurt pretty bad, but he tore off his bandages. Why? Tor was here. Lock. Looks like it's controlled remotely. needs a knob. A security computer. Day, then month. He uses European formatting. The Koskala brothers aren't just in the cult. They're its damn leaders. Needs a password. And a warrant, technically. But hey, desperate times. The computer controls the door that Tor went through. Hmm. I have what I need to figure out the password. That's not right. 
Tor left the wellness center. Tor is being targeted. He needs help. Poor Anderson had lightning in his veins. This was rock and roll, baby. That Weaver girl had cast a spell on him. Tor would do anything she'd ask. Tor deserved this. Tor wanted this. She wanted the song, a gift. He had to get it for her. Afterwards, it was too late. Tor swung his hammer in frustration. The spark was gone. Black liquid clogged his mind. A bad trip. Tor fought it. He was strong. He'd never be taken. But the darkness could still drown him. Tor needed to warn someone. It was all happening again. Tom was back. Coming back. Tom would need help too if he was going to make it. But the brothers were too old to stop at this time. Tor had called someone. Someone who could help. The name escaped him. Drowned beneath dark water. And the doors are open. There's Tor. And he's out of his mind. Need to get to him. Must be locked from the other side.
Catch up with Tor. This must have been Tor's. You come out of here this minute! That water is bad! 